This was an IPO that was talked about to some extent. For what it's worth, I've never played Candy Crush. I've never either. Ever. That makes three of but us here. We're in the minority, not in the minority, <laughs> but a lot of people play this game. What's interesting is, even though the uh, people who use this game on a monthly basis are in the millions, um, only 4% of them actually pay for the game. And the way that it works is you pay basically to get ahead. You pay. Uh, you buy little things in the game that allow you to advance within the game and that are useful to you, but it's only 4% of the people who use it on a monthly basis. Um, in addition to that, uh, we were looking at this to figure out is this a filing under the Jobs Act. The company did make about over $600 million in revenue in the fourth quarter of last year on about $159 million in profit. So is turning a profit, unlike some other recent digital IPOs, really the bulk of the company's revenue and the bulk of the users are using Candy Crush, even though it has about 180 games that it has developed. The bulk of them using Candy Crush. It does have a couple of other games, but but you wonder if they're just striking while the iron's hot, and if there are questions, there sure. will be questions later whether they even uh, come. They should command be commanding such a high valuation. Sure, it's sort sure. of Farmville and Drag. Exactly. <laughs> and, look at, and, you have to look at the Zynga and, example, the, 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 Julie. There, there's two kinds of games. There's the ones that 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 you, you play because they're they're fun, and there's ones you play to get ahead and pay for it. And, and there's a very flawed model. Uh, you know, purple cows used to be the, the cow du jour in Farmville. And you, you could advance your, your farm, so to speak, by paying. And are, are these really sustainable models? Zynga, right. Zynga's showed they're not. And Zynga's only hope is to get into gambling gaming. Uh, it, you know, this, That's true. Th th you're as good as your last hit. You're as good as your last player who was willing to pay for a... Uh, Purple cow in one instance, and I guess what are they paying for now to get ahead in in uh, in uh, Candy Crunch? I, I don't even know honestly yeah. how much it costs <laughs> per per candy to, to but get I think, ahead. But I think, but I think, Leo, you're right. I mean, to your point, right. I mean, that's always the question with any of these IPOs of the uh, of these not only gaming apps, but you know, Groupon as well, and then Twitter, and and and, and everyone else that comes out to the market. The first, yeah, the first one was Electronic Arts, which right. which had just an unassailable position of dominance until other games were created that were better.